what I love most about my parish community is their generosity and their support. I think that when you meet people who you've never met before and they're just so willing to help you out with anything that you have, whether it's their prayers, their encouragement, you know, their, their cars, their lifts to church or their fundraising, whatever it is, they're always willing to help you. And that's such an amazing and inspiring thing, especially as a young person in the church, to have all that support there for you. You know, you have somewhere to go if you have been, um, you know, persecuted for your faith or you have been trampled by it. You have this amazing group of people who are so willing to help you with anything that you have. How I hope to grow in my faith in years to come will be to continue to help out in any area that I'm needed in. So whether that is um, youth group or maybe when I move on it'll be um, helping out in the parish or the school community or wherever I'm needed um, out there in the world. And I think that that's how if I continuously immerse myself in it and immerse myself around those who are so passionate about their faith that I will just automatically catch on and will grow in my own and will be nurtured and from there I will just strive to be a better Catholic and a better person for Christ and for all those around me. So how I hope to share my faith in years to come will be by being exposed to the faith. I think that when I learn from others, I'm just so willing to share because it, once, you, once you grab onto Christianity and, and Catholicism, you can't not share it. It's, it's impossible to kind of hold it into yourself and it's almost selfish to hold it into yourself. You really have to burst out and let it go because once you know this, you can't, you can't keep it to yourself. It's impossible. You really want to tell others and even if that's not going around speaking it, it's, it's more little things like your actions and even little things like make a sign of cross before grace kind of thing, you know, when you're in a you know, busy cafeteria kind of thing. And, and that will, in some way, share my faith with others, when I, and especially when I grow older as well and I meet new people and they don't know who I am or they don't know that I'm Catholic. By doing little things through my actions, I hope to share that and they can just see and, and have me as a witness to what Christ is really calling them to be and to do with their lives.